BSJ. Make standards work for you. People like to feel safe. People want to know the products they buy are of good quality. People believe in getting value for money. Ensuring that people get all that is the responsibility of the Bureau of Standards Jamaica. The BSJ was created to establish and enforce standards of quality for goods and services and to help companies maintain high standards in the interest of all. The mission of the Bureau of Standards is to promote the international competitiveness of Jamaican producers, facilitate trade and protect consumers by providing standardization, metrology and regulatory services through visionary leadership, consultations, teamwork and a committed, motivated and professional workforce. The Bureau issues products and planned certification marks that tells local and international markets that the products and services displaying these marks have met current standards and regulations making them high in quality. The Bureau of Standards Jamaica has been working to raise product and service standards for over 40 years. It is a member of the International Standards Organization, ISO, which attests to the quality of goods from 161 member countries worldwide. I think that it has established itself as a very important national institution in the, the, in the quality infrastructure of the country. And uh, I, uh, there is no way we are going to move forward, especially with, with, in the free market, without a strong Bureau of Standards being at the center of, of everything that happens. By collaborating with national, regional and international partners, the BSJ is working in your best interest. As part of ongoing efforts to raise standards in Jamaica, the Bureau recently upgraded and retooled several of its laboratories. We now have modern state-of-the-art equipment and freshly trained staff to raise your products and services to new standards and delivery of top-end products. Our building and non-metallic laboratory is fully mobilized to help you meet new levels of health and safety and to protect our most precious resources, our people. We are ready to help you to push your business to the head of competition. One of the laboratories that have been revamped is in the Civil Engineering Unit. Here, tests are carried out on concrete blocks, aggregates, cement and concrete, the most important components in construction. Testing protects against concrete failure in homes and offices, in bridges and other structures in the built environment, with much focus being placed on stress requirements for natural disasters. Block composition with respect to size and ingredients must meet certain requirements as improper composition can lead to weak or defective blocks and therefore building failure, especially during earthquakes and hurricanes. Concrete blocks fail due to improper cement aggregate ratio, that is, too much crushed stone or sand to each bag of cement, too much or too little water per bag of cement, and improper curing of blocks caused by limited time and inappropriate environmental conditions. Improper storage of cement and other raw materials can also result in concrete failure. Cement should not get damp and should be stored on wooden pallets away from walls. And aggregates, sand or gravel, should be stored away from oil or sewage water. Here are a few bureau standards that should help ensure that concrete products are built to good standards. Water used in block making should be drinking quality. Concrete mixture must be done by machine to ensure consistency. Aggregates must be crushed stone and or washed sand, no marl. Concrete mixture must be used within a half hour of mixing. Technical staff is at your service in the Concrete Blocks Laboratory to test and certify blocks. Certified and registered block manufacturers are added to the Bureau's compliance list on a regular basis. Their products are given an A or a B grade, which indicates most appropriate use in construction. We conduct island wide monitoring of the block makers. Um, in this monitoring, we check for the dimension of blocks, the length, the width, and the height. Um, we also check for the um, volume of cavity and the compression testing strength of the blocks. 
so that they meet the satisfactory standards. In compression testing, what we actually do um, is measure the amount of force a block can withstand before it actually breaks and ensuring the safety of a building that is being erected. Look out for our next feature when we will talk about our standards for aggregates and ready mixed concrete, how you can get the best in the business and supply the best on the market. Mark our word, standards can work for you. BSJ, standards work for you.